Hello dear, welcome to my channel. In our previous video, we discussed about rounding of numbers to the nearest thousands. For today's video, we will be discussing about rounding of numbers to the nearest ten thousands. When rounding numbers, it is very much important that we know the rule in rounding numbers. And the rule in rounding numbers says that we round a number up if the digit we are rounding is followed by 5, 6, 7, 8, or 9. And we round a number down if the digit we are rounding is followed by 4, 3, 2, 1, or 0. Okay now, what are the steps to follow in rounding of numbers to the nearest ten thousands? Well, let's take a look at this example. Round 37,596 to the nearest ten thousands. Step 1. Label each digit with the correct place value. So we will label each digit of the number 37,596 with the correct place value. We will start from here. 6 is in the ones place. So O here stands for ones. 9 is in the tens place. So T here stands for tens. And 5 is in the hundreds place. H stands for hundreds. And 7 is in the thousands place. TH stands for thousands. And 3 here is in the ten thousands place. So TTH stands for ten thousands place. Since we will be rounding this number to the nearest ten thousands, so I will underline the place value of ten thousands here to be ready for step two, which is to identify the digit to be rounded off. Okay, since we will be rounding this number to the nearest ten thousands, so we will be identifying the digit found under the ten thousands place and the digit found under the ten thousands place is three therefore three is the digit that we need to round off okay now that we have already identified the digit to be rounded off let's now do step three which is to identify the digit found at the right side right side of the digit we are rounding just always remember that if the digit to be rounded off is followed by five six seven eight or nine round up if the digit to be rounded is followed by four three two one or zero round down and the digit found at the right side of three here is seven since the digit we're rounding here is followed by 7, so we will round up. Since we will be rounding up, we will add 1 to 3. Since 3 is the digit that we are going to round off. So I will rewrite this number here so I can clearly show you how to round this number up. So 37,596. And the digit that we're rounding here is 3. So again, since we are rounding up this number, so we will add 1 to 3. Since 3 is the digit that we are rounding. So 3 plus 1 is equal to 4. After adding 1 to the digit that we are rounding, we will now do the next step, which is step 4. And this is to change all the digits to the right side of the digit we are rounding into zero so since there are four digits here which are seven five nine and six so we will change all these digits into zero so three i mean seven will become zero five will become zero nine will become zero and six here will also become zero Okay, and then what is the last step? The last step says that we're going to copy the digit or digits found at the left side of the digit we are rounding. Since there is no digit at the left side of 3 here, so we have nothing to copy. 
And our final answer here is 40,000. So, 37,596 rounded to the nearest thousands. The answer is 40,000. Very easy, right? Okay, so that's all for today. Thanks for watching. This has been your teacher M saying, keep learning, keep growing. Bye!